Babe, what's the what's the thing that you love almost as much as me? Food. <laughs> <laughs> AKA right. snacks. Hey world. So listen. I got some new hair. Okay, this is from Sunbird Hair and Girl. I feel like we taking it back to where we started when we were doing the headband wig. So this is a headband wig. <laughs> I'm super excited about, about this particular headband wig because we're going back to what I love. Y'all know for me, the thing that I love the most is I love my curly hair. So this is a curly hair unit. So shout out to uh, Son Burr for collaborating with this portion of the video. They did send me this hair. Um, but you guys who have ordered anything that I recommended when it comes to hair, you know that if it's not a good quality, I don't really fool with it. I really like good quality hair. Um, and I've been asked so many times to review so many things. And as you see, like, I just, that's just not something that I do. I'm not just going to review things just so you guys can buy them and waste your money. Like, ain't nobody got time for that. So, I do have this beautiful curly unit. Girl, it's gorge. It's gorge. And it's from Summer Hair. And hopefully, now y'all know, because we not been through this before. Uh, hello? Girl, we not been through this before. Y'all know I got a big old dome, okay? So, hopefully it will fit. Let me go ahead. Now, I have a really slight stocking cap on. Don't judge me. And my hair is braided down. So, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? How that's going to look. However... Let me go ahead and, oh, before I step it on, let me show you this. They did send me, like, a couple of headbands. Just simple, you know, spring-type headbands. And then, of course, these blinged-out headbands, which I absolutely love. But let me go ahead and take a look at this. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Is it being hair friendly? Wait a minute. I do believe so. Wait. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait, wait a minute. I've had so many of these types of wigs, but one thing about it is I do feel like they've been getting better and better and better. And better. So here, let me. This is the hard part. Especially for me in these heavy rooms. That I got. Woo, what? I love it. So I'm just gonna. To get a more natural look for me, I typically like to push this back. Because I feel like. When it's too close, it's not as cute. I'm not gonna put no moves or nothing, but literally, one, two, three. Y'all, I love these wigs. When they're so easy. Like, literally, that took me how long? Not even five minutes. I think I took longer talking to you about it than I did putting it on now listen let's just talk about this now for some of y'all girls y'all girls are basically fancy and y'all can do all the suits and all the switch swatches and the switch aways and the baby hairs and the air the baby hairs that go into your eyebrows y'all know y'all been following me for a while that's not my ministry for whatever reason that's not my ministry don't you do me girl one thing about Joy Amore is she gonna be her. Okay, so let me. I never ever imitate. I'm always original. So look, I do kind of like these blinged out headbands, especially not when they're not super tight. I don't like it when you can still see the black headband under it, but I do like these. I do find them cute. 
I think sometimes though more with a straight unit than with this unit. Mm, I don't like it like this. What you think? I don't, mm -mm. That's not cute to me. I don't like that. Listen, y'all already know. Y'all will be seeing this unit until it falls off because it was easy, it was simple, and it was seamless. So again, shout out to Sumber. Let me put it this way. A shout out to Sumber Hair for sponsoring and collaborating this portion of the video. Thank you so much. I really appreciate you guys. So now, come spend the day with me, girl. Let's see what we got going on. All these opportunities were just across the bridge. The world was more than twice the size of now I was a kid. Traded in the comfort zone for life, I'm on the edge. I was gaining all my dreams, holding tightly to the pledge. Queen for some cute loungewear. Make sure to check out my previous Shein haul just in case you missed it. There's a card up here. So just click. To the label back when the bars were bland. Man, I'm my word though, I follow through on prior engagement. The tip of my tongue not far from the innovation. Now it's mine for the taking. Tell the people mistaking me for somebody to toy with the plug, the ox to play me. Time was paralyzed. I felt the strain to stretch my lungs. Confidence depleted right along with. Okay, girl. So here's the ginger jar. This is how I have it situated on the table i absolutely love it it's so beautiful it was literally 39.99 or 29.99 basically it was 30 dollars. so i got my glamour book which is basically like you know women first of all happy women's history month but it's like 30 years of women and then my chanel book and then this which i got from bath and body works and then that flower, I got that from Home Goods. The pillar candles we got from the Dollar Tree. And the ginger jar. So y'all tell me, like, does it fit in here? Like, the, the dining room is a work in progress, girl. At least the tree is down. But I like it. I think it's cute. You know what I'm saying? I still got to kind of clean up. Things ain't looking. Don't look at that spot right there. Y'all know I was spot on my couch. Chris always put his feet on my couch to do stuff. But anyway, so we're going to have to see, like, if that ginger jar should stay that color or should I change it? I also, another thing I want to do is curtains. And I want to take this love, family love, because that's been up there since my mom was here. Um, And I want to take it down and do something different. Maybe, like, work towards a memorial for her. Like, maybe, like, on this wall Something like right there. I don't know. You guys tell me what you think. But I do want some curtains and some type of art to go right here. So y'all keep me posted. Let me know what you think about the ginger jar. Should I paint it? I think someone told me that I needed to change the color that they would paint it. So what would you do if you have this ginger jar? Like how would you style it? And how would you like to see it look? Okay. So let me. So go up. <clears throat> I'm sorry, I'm loud. Did you have your headphones in? I apologize. So, yeah, let me know exactly what you think. Because, you know, y'all have some good design ideas. And I love talking to you guys about design. So, let me know exactly what you think. Because I do want to change some things around. Now, listen, this is the garland from Christmas. I've asked your favorite guy ten times, hey, can you take this garland down? <laughs> he haven't taken it down yet. So, hopefully... You know what I'm saying? When he get a chance, he will take it down. So, I styled my ginger jar, but we still got Christmas decorations up. But at least it's not a tree, girl. At least it's not a tree. I'm just saying. At least it's not a tree. I'm waiting on Bay to come. Wow. Okay, well, I guess I told Bay we were going to the park. I said we were going to the park, honey. Oh, yeah, so you're going to get food. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I got to bring my own food. Babe, what's the what's the thing that you love almost as much as me? Food. <laughs> <laughs> AKA snacks. snacks.
eyes agree It's almost like when we first met Oh, I don't care, it's getting too late I want you and I can't wait Don't wanna spend a minute without you I know you feel the same So come on, give me love I'ma show you how to move, how to move with my body Come hit me with your touch And make me wanna say they made sure it's a dollar twenty-five. It's a dollar twenty-five. So give me all you got. So you know, can't get that one of these whiskey cups. Two of them. Come back up, say whiskey on them. I don't want them to say whiskey. You like those whiskey glasses? Mm-hmm. Dollar twenty-five too. No longer the Dollar Tree. Yo, I love this unit. I really do. My edges aren't popping as usual, but I really love this unit. But anyway, y'all, this little three-piece set, this little lounge set is definitely a must-buy. It is she in, believe it or not. Um, now, I'm just going to tell you right now. Your drawers is going to be longer than the shorts. Okay? Your, your drawers might be hanging longer than the shorts. Okay? You're definitely going to have... Your yams is going to be out. Okay? She in will have all of your yams out. I just want you to know that. So listen, I want to show y'all. I have a um, one of these cards. Girl, I'm trying to be I N D E P E. I card from Target, and I need your help. I need help putting it together. This girl is just. Let me show you. Hold on. The lighting ain't good over here. Let me take you over so I can show you. And bring you closer. Hold on. Hold on one moment, so please. Okay, so here's the garment rag. This is what it's supposed to look like once you get it put together. So I'm going to go ahead and get into it and see if we can get it put together, girl. And then I'll show you the update. Girl, what is that right there underneath the couch? is it anyway i see more stuff on this camera than i see on a daily basis i'm telling you this camera tells all of your business oh it must be a rose petal that got to the wayside but anyway okay so i'll go ahead and see if we can get this put together girl let's see girl i want to go ahead and say hello to bob the builder for coming to help a sister out while she was in need, girl. Because look, but this thing is way taller. Is there any way to make it shorter? Oh yeah. It's right. way taller and way bigger than I thought it was. So let me show you sure, let me what we got. Can you see it? Oh. Here we go. No, it's shorter. But we're gonna have to bring that light. Mm -hmm. Hold on, girl. Okay, girl. So, this is what we got from Target. I don't, I'm gonna be honest with you. It doesn't feel super sturdy. Like, I mean, the ones on Amazon be like, okay, 250 pounds, you can hang on it. This one, I don't know. And I'm going to put it, I'm not 100% sure where I'm going to put it at just yet, but Bae's right? putting the, the wheels on it for me. Thank you. So that way around. it can be rolled around. So what? So you can roll it around where you need it. <laughs> where you want it. So we're getting the wheels. So we got that accomplished today. So we see teamwork make the dream work. 
I couldn't get the wheels on them, but hey, we're gonna ride it till the wheels fall off. That's what it is. Okay, y'all, I got that Sephora set up. As you probably seen, I want to show you guys what I got from Sephora. I actually got a brand new perfume and something different. So I'm gonna show you that. I also want to show you what I got from um Old Navy. I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to see this first or the old navy shop with me first, but yeah, girl. Uh, period. Sephora. They were out of a lot of things, but I think I had told you guys about this little trip that I had taken over there. But so, like I said, they were they had the Fenty Beauty. Um, this is the hydrating longwear foundation, which I actually don't like. Um, I prefer the matte finish, the pro filter, um, or the, you know what I'm saying, matte finish, but this was $16. They didn't have my color. My color is 470. So I got a 460 and a 480 to kind of mix them together. Both of them are the wrong color. If anything, I'd be more towards 480 than anything, but I do like a more neutral or golden either or, but anyway. So I got a Fenty Beauty um, Fly Liner, Longwear Liquid Liner. So I'm gonna try that. This is Cause I'm Black, period. That never works for me, I don't know why I keep trying. This is Hot Chocolate. Now, I love their um, lippies. I got Fussy, which I have more on now, which is pink, but comes off kind of like. But to me, the color doesn't last long. It's like the color comes off in the beginning, but then all of a sudden it's like, oh, oh no. So there's that one, and then there's. Ooh, oh, I could hardly open it. The hot chocolate one. Pretty much brown. I love the way they smell. So then there's that. Now let me show you this perfume. I'm excited. This is Good Girl Carolina Herrera Supreme. Now, this one is a little bit different. Now, I do have Dossier. Y'all know I absolutely love Dossier, right? Dossier always collaborates with me. So, shout out to Dossier for collaborating with me. I've been with Dossier for a long time. Um, you guys know Dossier gives us designer quality for a portion, right, of the price. Now, this... Let me just tell you... Now, this was, I purchased with my own money. You know, Sephora ain't, they ain't checking for you, girl. So, this particular perfume was, um, 107. Carolina Herrera. So, it was 107 for this one. And this is the... 50 milliliter or 1.7 ounces. Now, let me get you the Dossier Good Girl. Excuse my stomachs. Okay, so the Dossier version of the Carolina Pereira is, I believe, Fruity Almond. The scents in this one is Almond, Peach, Oris, Orange Blossom, Vanilla and Tonka bean. 
with me. Now, this is a little bit different because this is the Supreme. Most fragrances from Dossier, you're looking at about, I don't know, maybe $29 for most. This one, though, was the last one in the store. Now, I have not liked pretty much any of the other um, Good World. Really, to be honest with you. I always love the bottle. So, here's this bottle. Here's the bottle. And let me, I don't wanna spray it. Cause I don't know if I'm gonna like it. Oh yeah, that's me. Yeah, I like that. Now this is the first one. Let me see, cause it does, you're right, you're right. Spray it on your hand because it smells different when you spray it on yourself than it does when you just spray it in the air or in the box. But why do I keep wanting? I keep wanting to go like this. Girl, that ain't how you do it. Let's see. Wait, does this does this make a difference? Does this make a difference, girl, or no? All over my body. Yeah. That's a summer spring fragrance. It's light. It's not too heavy. It's very feminine. It's very flirty. It's young. I really like it. So this is the Good Girl, Carolina Herrera Good Girl Supreme, right? Dossier doesn't have the Supreme, but they have the Fruity Almond, which has that some of those bases and those notes that are in the Good Girl. That's pretty much the same. Listen, if you want to save money when you get in your Dossier, you guys know, go down below in the description box. I always have a discount code from you guys. I don't get any type of like affiliate link with Dossier. They pay me to... Um, they send me the perfume. They pay me to do the review. I don't get a kickback from what you purchase, but I always ask, hey, can I get a coupon code for you guys so that way you can save you some coins? Because like I said, I like to budget and, you know, plan to buy a perfume. Like, I'm not always able to just say, okay, I'm going to go buy um, $1,200 worth of perfume. Like, I'm not going to just do that. You know what I mean? So sometimes I'm like, okay, let me go ahead and just, get the dossier and then sometimes i still don't end up getting the real one sometimes i i go ahead and get it like with mark jacobs perfect i had the dossier version first and then i went and got the real one um let's go over here and look at my perfume so i can kind of tell you some of my favorite my favorites because you guys asked me like hey what's your favorite perfume but um these are not all of my perfumes these are just some of my some of my favorites so like this is kind of like <laughs> where they go um this is Dose and gabbana is that light getting on your nerves i'm sorry is that better this is Dose and gabbana rose this is a i love that um one that I do want to get, but girl, it's $300, is that Amberry Cherry. I mean, that um, Tom, For Tom Ford Cherry. I didn't think I was going to like it because it's a unisex fragrance. And I'm very much so a feminine girly girl. I like girly girl fragrances. I don't like unisex fragrances, but this Amberry Cherry Dossier has it. But also, I want that Tom Ford one. That's one of my favorite. Um, this is what I believe this is Mom Perry. I don't see the other one, so it must be. Um, Y'all let me know if I'm wrong, but Wild Self, I love that. And believe it or not, I like my new Valentino. It smells, mm, smells good. 
And I smell my clothes, and I feel like this stays on my clothes after I finish with it. So, yeah, like I said, check out Dossier, you guys. It's not a commercial. It's just me letting you know, hey, I like it. I like to compare it because that's their whole claim to fame is, hey, you know, try Dossier because we're just as good as the regular perfume or lasts just as long or it smells just as good as whatever. Well, if that's the case, let's compare and contrast, girl. Let's compare and contrast. Okay, girl, so I'm doing a try-on haul. I'm not, listen, I don't know when the order of things are going to come out. So, I don't know if you've already seen the try-on haul or if it's coming out next. But make sure that you tune in and check out the try-on haul for this particular dress because it is Shein. And it's really, really cute. And they have it in other colors. So, I just wanted to see if I can get this done, the Shein haul, really quick before we go and do hair stuff. So, I want to go ahead and get the Shein haul done, then go do hair videos. So, I will see you in a minute, girl. I love covers. Really? Oh, I love Chuck. They too narrow, I think. So, they're not made for people with wide feet. You like Reeboks, Nitra? I made it to the salon. I can't believe it's so quiet. Mm-hmm. On a week that on a and I'm I'm shocked. Oh, I did. I made it perfect. Cause so then if I was in here at eleven, it wouldn't work. So I did good. Then. Wow. So I got a question. Is it a requirement to be fine to be a a, a beautician? Cause my beautician fine. <laughs> Is that one of your requirements when you finish school? <laughs> you gotta be fine to be a beauty to do hell. Nidra, how old are you? 40? 43. 43, yes. And period. I will be 44 here soon. Hashtag, she's 44. 44, April 4th. But April 4th. But take it. Yes. But take it. Oh, Chris, you hush. <laughs> <laughs> you see how Chris tried to, he tried to cop lock. <laughs> Why you hating, Chris? <laughs> and not single. So don't put in your application. <laughs> That's Chris' sister, child. You say he be all in her business. He worry about who outside. Chris ain't gonna let you get nothing. God, dog. No. Okay, we gotta get to work. <laughs> so, really quick, in between work, I wanted to come over here and go to Chick-fil-A really quick. Well, I can't say really quick because this is an example of really quick. Girl, I don't think there's ever been a time in history where you can come to Chick-fil-A and there's not a line. But the good thing about Chick-fil-A that I love, other than the fact that they say, my pleasure, is that you're going to be in and out. So, I think I want a lemonade. Um, a, you know, not sugar-free, but what is it? A diet lemonade. And I want a salad. Chicken salad. Mm -hmm. But I don't do their dressing because their dressing have like 5,000 calories and I don't understand why. So I just get their salad, eat half of it, do the lemonade, and use my own uh, Ken's light dressing because it's like, like literally, I think their dressing is like 300 calories for the packet. And I think Ken's dressing is like 100 calories. For the serving so it's like you can basically eat at chick-fil-a for less than like 650 or so calories you know what i'm trying to say it's like a it's like a what you tell yourself like oh this is a good cheat girl this is a good cheat but anyway i'll see y'all when we get our food and get to the house girl where did this rain come from i'm melting i'm melting it's raining Okay, girl, so we made it all the way back home with our salads and lemonade. 
Bay is a little salty because unfortunately the young lady um gave him the wrong salad. As y'all know, Bay doesn't eat bacon. They put fried chicken on it. Um so but I guess it's our fault because we didn't really check the bed. So I'm gonna call up there and let them know. But I'm gonna go ahead and eat my salad. 